All right, so in this question, we have a statement that we are going to turn into a mathematical expression and see which one of the following an answers represents the statement correctly. All right, so let's read out loud as we write the, the statement. Y is equivalent, so Y equals to 10 times the value of X, 10X, divided by 5. All right, so this is our statement in mathematical terms, and if we simplify this, we have Y equals 2X. Now let's see which of our following answers represents y equals 2x the best. So let's go to um, option A. We have 0 and 0, so if we plug in these values, we have 0 equals 2 times 0, which, e which equals 0 equals 0. And this is correct. Now let's move on to our next one. We have 2 equals 2 times 1, which gives us 2 equals 2, which is also correct. And our third point, 4 and 2, or 2 and 4, so we have 4 equals 2 times 2, which gives us a correct answer. And our fourth point, 6 equals 2 times 3, which also gives us a correct answer. And our last point, 8 equals um, 2 times 4, which also gives us a correct statement, 8 equals 8. So A will be the correct answer, and let's quickly go over why B, C, and D are incorrect. Now let's do the same for B. Let's plug in our first point. So we have negative 25 equals 2 times negative 2, and these two values do not equal one another. We have 25 that does not equal negative 4. Therefore, we can eliminate B as an option. All right, now C and D are both graphs, and if we take a look at C, we have the correct y-intercept right over here at 0. But if we take a look, let's say at an, an example of a point, let's say we take the value for x to be 10. If we plug in y equals 2 times 10 for the value of x, we should be having a y that equals 20. And the y here is not close to 20. It should be way up here. Therefore, c is incorrect and can be eliminated. Now d we can automatically tell that it is not the correct answer because the y-intercept for the y-intercept does not go through the zero, the the origin of the axis. So therefore, D can also be eliminated, and A will be our final answer.